What's up YouTube? This is Dennis Panuta for Tutorials.eu. Let's talk about a very interesting question you might already have asked yourself. You used Google, Stack Overflow, YouTube, books and online courses to teach yourself coding. However, now you come to the point where you are wondering, do I need a college degree to get a job as a developer? Is it really worth paying thousands, even hundreds of thousands of dollars in some countries to get a degree? Well, in the past, a college degree might have been a requirement, but things have changed. As a developer, you're at a great spot. In most countries, there aren't even enough developers. So companies are desperately searching for programmers. In Germany alone, for example, are over 70,000 open job offerings for the job programmer. How are they supposed to find that many programmers with a degree? What matters for those companies is not so much your degree, but your skills and portfolio, which is sort of a proof of your skills. You get paid for what you do, not what you know. So then is to say a degree is worthless? No, of course not. While around 60% of the jobs out there on the market do not require a degree, the other 40% do require it. Not only that, with a degree you definitely have a bigger job selection you can choose from. In some countries, a degree is more important than in others. In some companies, a degree is even a must. But no worries, there are still enough jobs for self-taught programmers. A survey on Stack Overflow, the most trusted forum with millions of programmers, has shown that the bigger part of them are self-taught and still have a job. Summing it up, the project you finish are worth more than what you have learned at university. That said, we can say that you don't need a degree to get your favorite IT job as a full-time, part-time or even self-employed developer. You want to become an app developer? Well, then just create some Android apps and put them on the Play Store. You prefer web development? Build a website for the pizza restaurant next door and use this as a reference for your next job interview. What matters is that you build your portfolio and have skills in the areas that you apply for. So, no worries if you don't have a degree. Just keep on going. What's your opinion? Are you a self-taught programmer and have a job? Or are you on your way to becoming one? Please share your thoughts with us in the comments below. And by the way, if you want to keep up to date with programming topics and want to get notified about our latest free project tutorials, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell. Lions roaring in the morning sun Searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come we must never stop the way